Hello brilliant people welcome to all this is your favorite divya and today the topic we are going to discuss is retromolar pad area and the papilla so let's begin retromolar pad area is an anatomical landmark of the mandible mandible it contains glandular tissues and loose areolar connective tissue okay there are certain muscles which join at the retromolar pad area okay so posteriorly it is temporalis okay posteriorly temporalis which is basically a tendon so tendon of temporalis posteriorly forms the boundary of the retromolar pad area and inserts at this point the lateral boundary is formed by the buccinator muscle medially it's the pterygo mandibular raphe medially and superiorly it's constrictor superior constrictor muscle okay these muscles join here at the retromolar pad area now if the question comes the muscles which forms the retromolar pad these are the muscles which are tendon of temporalis posteriorly or the we can say the constituents of the retromolar pad posterior its temporalis tendon superior constrictor muscle pterygo mandibular raphe and the buccinator muscle and it's a pear shaped area by pear shaped the reference is the structure is narrower from one side and broader from the other and anterior to this is the retromolar papilla it's anterior to the retromolar pad and a pear shaped structure like it and it contains dense fibrous connective tissue okay this is it thanks for watching please hit the like button subscribe to the channel for more such videos happy studying bye bye for now